Okay, top secret. It was really overwhelming. I was I, I was just trying to get all the steps right because it was like first red carpet, first, you know, big performance, first everything. So um, yeah, it was good. Yeah, I think I'm feeling it now. It's like now that the dust has settled because like you're in the moment, you're at, you're collecting the award, none of it feels real. It's now where suddenly it's like, okay, there's a title to live up to here. And it's kind of an impossible title. Some days it gets to you and some days you just can't think about it at all. I don't think I'll ever be that used to it. I think that's the funny thing with like being an artist nowadays so much of it isn't music still not used to like having to be on ca in camera and do social media and all that kind of stuff that comes with it i'm like i'm just used to being in the studio and writing songs so yeah do you know what slightly annoying me in that documentary because she was just playing nice she was suddenly like the cameras were on and she was just like playing all innocent she was like hi you know i'm proud of sarah blah 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 and i was like this is not who you are. But no, she's cool. She's just um, completely unimpressed by all of the music stuff. I, I actually didn't have very many friends in school. Uh, by the end of school, I kind of had like one best friend and that was it. So it's not like I see any of them now. It's quite, like I've still got my best friend Rose and then that's it really. So. so I really was just like, I hated like anyone knowing about it. I don't know, I just think it's cooler to for things to be successful and let that speak for itself than like talking about it too early. And then now I get the odd DM, like a guy in the year above being like, oh, fair play, you're doing really well. Or like, <laughs> you know, the odd message from a teacher. But I feel like I just have to know what it's like to to have a week with Jack Antonoff at some point in my life. It's obvious, but like Max Martin, I just, it'd be interesting to see what kind of hit he would write for me. <laughs> I, I find like the whole collaboration thing quite hard. I'm up for working with so many people. It's more just like he would be up for working with me. You know? Favorite music video ever of all time. Do you know what music video I actually really love that's a modern one? Um, back to You by Selena Gomez. I know I go back to you. Styling's nice, it's fun, it's shot beautifully, yeah. Favourite one so far? Maybe Say It Again? Okay, top secret, I don't love any of my music videos at all. I think I find them so hard to get right. I'm really proud of it. I think it was definitely a labour of love over lockdown, like suddenly just being in this room by myself trying to figure out what the hell I wanted to say. Especially because in lockdown you write it in quite a private way. It's weird now that it's out into the world, do you know what I mean? But um, it's nice. Thank you.